the points for ETE corresponding to the applicant's qualification. Listen ha, mabasa man ninyo, let us read together the points for ETE, karang 30 points, the education, training, and experience corresponding to the applicant's qualifications exceeding the qualification standard shall be computed using the increments table and the ETE rubrics. Bangutana mo karon asa man ako makita ng ETE tab uh, increment table o ETE rubrics. I told you just a while ago, please download ang D07. No? Series of 2023. Naa din na. Naka-append naka din ha ang naka-append din ha ang atong na din na sa mga appendices. Na din na ang mga uh, increments table and rubrics. I appreciate much if you were able to download if you have your own copy now. Aron pag-discuss na ko, makasabay mo. Okay? Sige. Only those qualifications that are relevant to the position to be filled shall be given points. Claro ha? It's very clear. Only those qualifications that are relevant to the position to be filled shall be given position shall be given position naman. Points. So kung irrelevant, sorry, wala i points. Okay? So, increment table. This is how they define the word increments table. A tool that is used in determining the incremental points in the education, training, and experience obtained by the applicant that exceeds the minimum requirement per CSC approved qualification standards. So, Dapat, so they have said, dali-dali ah, kung pwede, naka-download mo ka ron. Okay na? So, mag-simulate na. Natay example. Okay, yung si Ma'am Wenny, very clear. Okay, thank you po, Ma'am Wenny. Sir, what with regards to the demonstration, applicant should be one that choose our way. Same day lang po ba ang demo in TR? And I will say, yes, yeah, sir, good morning. Will an applicant be considered disqualified if there are no certificates presented? Uh, and of course not. Dili pa. Kaya na pa may daghan components, no? Na pa man, under sa criteria. For those who have that experience, for those who have experiences in substitute teaching in depth, sir, how will our experience be calculated since only only have COE, for a performance rating? Ma'am Jessa, I uh, suggest uh, you approach your school principal and ask. So interview are included to the criteria when po on TRF, uh, now about the demo, sir, by quarter ba? Okay, that's proceed. Simulate ka. Okay. So, for example, this is a sample of the memo, no? Department of Education, Merit Selection Plan. Okay. So, Ed, Ed is looking for a teacher one in secondary. Mape. Sample ni siya, ha? Example ni. Akong klaruhon. Example ra ni siya. Basi may ngomog. Tag-hiring na po takaroon. Of course, nag-hiring ta. Pero sample na ni siya. Atong i-compute. For you to know on saan pag-compute ha. Okay? Sige, padayon ta. So, this is how it look like, no? Kanang i-post na to diha sa civil service or any three conspicuous places. So, if you notice, Kanang box din na sa QS, Qualification Standards. Sanawa, ang Teacher 1, item niya, Teacher 1, Education, Training, Experience, and Eligibility. Okay? Sample na siya. Sample. Okay. Now, 
So karon kay nag nag-post naman ni, so for example no, nag-post naman tani ni ah. Okay, natay na pili. We have shortlisted three teacher applicants. Okay. So again ha, nag-hire ta, nag-post ta og notice. Okay? Then out of the applicants, oni siya ang atong oni siya ang atong napili. Tulo. There are three applicants. Atong napili. Si Rambutan, si Apple, o si Buko. Bitaw si Rambutan, si Apple, o si Buko. Silang tulo. Si Sir Rambutan, si Ma'am Apple, o si Sir Buko. Kana silang tulog aplikante atong napili. Of course, atong i-compute. Okay. Now, proceed. So, klaro man din na sa slide, no? Klaro kay sa slide. Qualifications. Tulura nga itong i-computer na ang education, training, and experience. Si Rambutan, fresh grad. Ang education niya, graduate siya sa Bachelor of Science in Education. Ang pangutana, sulod ba? Relevant ba ihang kurso? Yes, no. Thumbs up kung yes. Thumbs down kung no. Sige ba? Let me see. Mangutana ko sa inyo. Kung. Ano nagkatawaha naman to? Muna iyang qualification. Muna iyang educational qualification. Pasok siya. Is it relevant? Okay. So, dagang tinatamsa. Okay, very good. Sige. Training niya. None. Fresh grad man. So, kulay training. Wala siya training. Wapo siya experience. Okay. So, unsa gani ang qualification standards para sa teacher one? Balik sa ako ha. Balik sa tahan. Tanawa gani. Qualification standards, education, BS Ed or Bachelor's degree, plus eighteen units in education. Bona yung qualification standard na BS Ed, Bachelor's degree, plus eighteen units. Bona siya ang kanang kani sila ray kani. No, 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 no. These are the kato mga teachers ba na applicants na nag take of eighteen units. Proof ed, yeah, proof ed. Yan ang proof ed nato. Okay, training non required, experience non required, but eligibility board passer RA ten eighty. Okay? Okay, klaro ha? So, education, BS Ed, or bachelor's degree plus 18 units. Proof Ed na siya. Training none, experience none. Parayong ko, balik ko ato sa slide. So, si Rambutan, si Sir Rambutan, ang education niya, Zero. Education niya is BS Ed. So, niingon mo, qualified siya. Yes, qualified siya. Training, none. Iyang experience, none. Si Ma'am Apple. Si Ma'am Apple, BS Ed graduate si Ma'am Apple. Okay? Naa siya 18 units for a master's degree in education. Naa siya 18 units ha? Sa master's degree. Okay. Muna i-catch sa ito din na. Plus 18 units. Graduate siya. Four-year course. Plus master's degree. 18 units. Dili siya full-fledged ha? 18 units. Training. Naa siya training na 32 hours training on curriculum. Contextualization. 
localization and lesson planning. Question, relevant ba yung training? As well as anihang educational qualification, relevant ba? Thumbs up kung yes, thumbs down kung no. Sige. Okay, very good. So, relevant ang iyahang educational qualification. Okay? Qualified siya because education graduate plus na a master's degree in education. Ha? Okay. Now, iyahang training is also relevant. Now, na a experience four years and three months as teacher associate in Marian Academy. Okay. So, na siya training, na siya experience rather teaching, no? In Marian Academy. Okay? So, paminaw lang, listen lang, kung ka na mga walang master work, tanawa lang din akong gidiscuss para masabtan. What about si Sir Buko? Si Sir Buko, graduate siya o BS Sports Science with 18 professional units in education. Ga-proof ed ni siya. Okay. Unsa unsa atong gi-hire? Teacher sa MAPE. Okay, again ha, teacher sa MAPE. Ni graduate si Sir Buko, ang iyang course is BS Sports Science. Then ni proceed siya, nagkuha siya 18 professional units. So proof ed siya. Question, relevant or irrelevant? Relevant or irrelevant? Relevant, thumbs up. Irrelevant, thumbs down. Be? Sige. Let me see. Unsa inyong answer? Okay. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumb Uy, heart man lagi ni. Okay. So, wala ni thumbs down. Okay. Very good. So, re relevant ang iyahang educational qualification. What about ang training ni Sir Buko? Ang training niya is 24 hours training on sports training and coaching. Okay, relevant ni Hapon. And then, aside from that, na siya teacher experience, teaching experience. Na siya six years and two months as teacher in Sacred Heart Academy Gusa. Ah, Gusa, Nubaliches. Okay? So, nagtudlo siya sa Sacred Heart. For six years. Okay. So, ato din yung himay-himayon karon. So, again ha. Tulo si Sir Rambutan, si Ma'am Apol, o si Sir Buko. Okay. Atong i-compute. Atong compute on. So, katong na ay transmutation table, katong rubric, be ready. Okay, naman yung Ingon rin, naka-download na siya. Thank you. Okay. So again ha, muna siya ang, mo-reflect din ha, is ang minimum qualification standard. Ha, muna yung minimum. Okay. Beside anang na ha, ang applicant's qualification, kang Sir Rambo. Okay. Education, BS Ed, training none, experience none. Karon, atong hukman, si Sir Rambo, using your rubrics. Okay. Meeting, kanawa ha? Okay. Very important ni siya. Meeting the minimum qualification standard or baseline requirements for education, training, and experience shall be given zero points. Alaka. 
Klaro ha? Meeting the minimum. Kung igo lang gid siya nakamit sa minimum QS, pilay points, zero. Okay? Daw ba karon Ang education ni Sir Rambo kay igo raman siya ni graduate of education. Do you think na any points? Tanaw na ito ha? Hala ka. Zero points. Igo lang siyang graduate. So, ang atong thoughts aning niya is that sa katong walay master's degree, No, masteral units or master kanang units lang dapat maghinahinay na mong kuha no e regardless kung asa mo na school no ang importante na ay mo plus points din na sa inyong educational qualification at as proceed training ang qualification nan wa man wa may qualification ang training sa teacher one pero it does not mean na kung wala ta nag ang minimum nato zero or none it does not mean na kung nakai training wala po na points of course na na points na corresponding points pero siya wala man siya training zero ya po niya ha same with experience it was not specified here na dapat na a none klaro kay none but again Having an experience is an advantage. And having a training is also an advantage. And having a uh, master's unit, masteral unit, is also an advantage for the part of the kanang, uh, applicant. Okay? So, wala. Balik ta ha? Si, Ra si Sir Rambo, zero. Wala points. Of course, sa tulo pa na, napay, napay rating, napay ang pivot rating, napay ang demo. No? Napay demo. Okay, proceed. Si Ma'am Apple. Si Ma'am Apple is an education graduate. 18 units for a master's degree in education. Na siya ay plus 18 units. Nakakuha, naka-enroll siya. Okay. Enroll na napagigrado. Dapat importante, grado na ni Pasar. Okay. Then, what about the training? She has a training also. 32 hours training on curriculum. Okay. Contextualization and localization and lesson planning. Nadiha ang date, January 26 to 29. Not like before na ang sa uh, DO6 sa una or 66 ba to na dapat Three days, minimum of three days. Karon is hours ang atong ginakompute. Hours. Now, ang maximum nato ana is seventy two hours. Manto sir odds no seventy two hours. Ko maximum na ng ten points. Now, of course, cumulative. Cumulative ta. Okay. Basta lagi it falls on within five years. Okay. Then, four years and three months ang iyahang teaching experience. So, can you guess kung pilay points na earn ni Ma'am Apple sa iyahang education? Qualification? Pilay points ka ha? Anyone can guess? Pwede ninyong isulat din eh kung pilay points. Sige. Minimum. Sa rubric din ha, ka nang nasa left side na ay level 1 until level 31. Na they range from 2. So, basic ta. Ano ta sa minimum 1? Can read and write. So, since bachelor's degree, ang basic na to is BE Ed, 
ang level ana is 6. Ilan ang pag-compute ha? This is how we're going to compute. 6 plus pangita ka din na ang 18 units. Nara o oh, kanang 11. Na ah, yan, 11. No? Level number 11. 18 units earned towards the completion of a master's degree. So, ang pag-compute na to, Ana, is ang 11, ano, 11, ang increment, Ana, ano, 11 minus 6, constant, ha? Ato ginang i- minus o i-subtract na to sa minimum qualification standard, which is 6 kina kay bachelor's degree man. So, ang highest niya is 11, uh, 11 no, 11, ang increment niya dia is 11, kay, kuwan man, uh, 18, 18 units man siya. So, 11 minus 6 equals 5. 5.5 na siya ang increment na to. Ang 5 da yun, tanaw ni mo sa taas sa rubric, sa education, tanaw din nila, ang 5 increment, 4 to 5 increments, ang equivalent points ana is 4. Tanaw sa taas. Okay? Look at the table. Upper portion. 4. Okay? Again ha, 4 to 5 increments, ang total points ana niya is 4 points. Okay, so that is na ang points na na-earn niya sa iyang education. Okay, so pananglitan kung complete ka academic requirement, car ka, car is, kuwan man ang car, 20. So 20 minus 6, ilan man, na kay 14. Ba? So, 20 minus 6 na kay 14. So, isumbra na ka. 14. For 10 or more increments. Pila may highest niya? 10. O, 10 na lang imong points din na. Okay. Palayon ka. What about ang training? Okay. Training. Training na po din siya na rubric. Okay, na table na to din ha. Training. So, training niya is ang, ang minimum qualification standard, zero man, none. Iya ha, is 32 hours. Tanawa ang 32. Aha na bilong. Five. Okay, level five. So, now, 32 hours sa training. So, five minus one. Okay, 5 minus 1 equals 4. Tanawa din ang rubric sa taas, sa training. 4 to 5 increments, total points niya 4. So, still 4 ang iyong points earned sa training. Okay? Am I clear? Sabtan ba? Sabtan ba? Okay, let me see. Thumbs up, flying, kung nasabdan. Okay. Uy, namay ng hiwi. <laughs> ano ka ni? Okay. So, sige, thank you. Padayon pa, let's continue. Experience. Again, experience, minimum, none, zero. Pero, si ma'am, Apple na as a four years. Let us try to see. Hmm. Four years experience na wala. Wala ang iyang rubric din sa wala ang rubric sa experience sa training naman na. Okay. Ano na? Ano na? Sa the right side. Okay. Training. Experience other. Experience niya is four years. Now then. A nine, four years. Okay, so nine minus one. Eight. Okay, eight. Eight plus eight, sixteen. Out of thirty points, sixteen rakang mam apple. 
Okay, that is how you are going to compute. Asabdan ba? Am I clear? So karon while you are sitting down, nanamoy, you can now imagine kung pila na points inyong makuha sa inyong education, training, and experience. Okay? Questions? Sabdan, sir. Salamat. Kena sabdan. Okay. Thank you. Now, next. Ako ang daliog. Igamayin lang ang oras. Kaning. Ah, kang binanato ni Apilon si Buko. Pasa ta ni Buko. Parihara man na siya. We will now proceed with the and in how to compute the board exam rating. So, 10 points nga po na siya. So, imong board exam rating, divide it by 100 times 10, mo na siya ang points ni mo. So, for example, ang imong board exam rating is 82.75 over 100 times 10, <coughs> mo na 8.275 ang imong points. So, upat na ta ka, criteria ang ato na solve. So, education, training, experience, and your pivot or let. So, that ends my topic. Thank you, then good luck. God bless everyone.